And hey guys, welcome to the first video on this channel. Uh, thank you guys for so, so, so much for watching. Uh, I'm not going to talk too much about it. Uh, let's get straight into the gameplay. Are you ready, kids? Aye, aye, Captain. I can't hear you. Aye, aye. stop it. That's cringe. Oh. Oh. All right. All right. If you guys know, I am somewhat of a Spongebob fan myself, as you can tell by that, and I'm going to show you real quick my... Yeah, I enjoy watching Spongebob on my free time. So, I have waited since like July 23rd. I pre-ordered this, and I have not played it since. So, let's get... I'm going to start a new game for you guys, and then we're just going to get... No. Yeah, like I said, we're gonna start a new game for you guys, and then we're gonna get straight into it. So let's get, let's get it. If you guys have not played this as your, in your childhood before, I recommend it. Uh, for me, I played it on the PlayStation 2, I 100% it. Uh, I am not a speedrunner, by all means, I am just here for the fun, right? Uh, I'm gonna keep this. to Bikini Bottom, a normally peaceful undersea sanctuary. Today, it will be transformed into a theater of pure horror. Wherein our little yellow friend will play the starring role. It's the Today's the big day. I have devised an ingenious plan to finally steal the Krabby Patty formula. And if Bikini I... Bottom happens to get demolished in the Pretty process, oh so well. <laughs> With my brand new Duplicatotron 3000, I'll clone an army like of it. robots that will wreak mayhem and destruction at my command. I mean, how could he not see the don't obey one sign right there? But with his big eye as well. Let's see. Item number one is Plankton a genius. Answer nah, yes. Okay, nah, checklist complete. Throw in the switch. The eagle is more well, bigger than your body, man. Obedient robot army. Hang on. I want to get a photo for my scrap. Oh. Hey, hello. Uh -huh. What do you think you're doing? Oh, I wonder, right? If you guys have not, if you guys, like I said, if you guys haven't played before, you guys, you guys, well, you guys don't. I made you. I made you. No, no. no. <laughs> this is such nostalgic for me. If you guys have played this before as well, you guys should know what happens. I know everything that happens. I think it's an exact remake of it. Another perfect day playing robots and racehorses. Yeah. Only I keep getting the racehorses and the robots mixed up. Wouldn't it be great if we had real robots to play with, Patrick? I'd name mine Robo Jr. or Zorlon or maybe Frankie. Yeah, these unreal robots are getting boring. Hey, what hey, if yo. we put the robots in here? Oh, how shellfish of you. <laughs> it's not just any shell. It's my magic wishing Wish shell. shell. Wow, that's <laughs> magic great, Patrick. So we put the toy robots in here. Okay. Then we say the magic wishing words and shake the magic wishing shell. Okay. Then we go to sleep, and in the morning, we'll have real oh, robots to play oh, with. Oh, but Patrick, aren't we going to say the magic wishing words? You already did! So, okay is the magic wishing word? It used to be Alakazama Alabala Wisna Tikitana Fushbar Griddle Bits Von Wiedeschnauzer, but I kept forgetting it. I have no Are idea you how sure I this will work. It. Sure! Last week I only had one big cookie crumb and I was really hungry. So I put my cookie crumb in the magic wishing shell. Then I said the magic wishing word and shook it. And in the morning I had lots of little cookie crumbs. Patrick, I proclaim that tomorrow is going to be the best day ever. Good night, SpongeBob. Good night, Patrick. The next morning. <laughs> Gonna play with robots, gonna play with robots, gonna play with robots, gonna play with... Whoa! Uh, Gary, did you do that? <laughs> Gary's kind of cute in this game. Well, I mean, he's cute in general, but... Or she, whoever Gary is.
he could he or she could be whatever she wants uh, he wants it's 2020 <laughs> all right yeah now. gary it sure looks like we're in a doozy of a pickle i think i'm gonna have to learn a lot in order to fix this mess yes yes you are what a fantastic idea these signs will provide important tips to help me out um how do i read the signs Meow. oh okay Press this button to read the signs. Hmm. Okay. Meow. So if I want to come back and talk to you again, just walk up to you and press this button. I'd better get started now, Gary. I think that this is going to be a very, very long, long day. Long day. All right. So we just gotta explore the kitchen, the bedroom, and the attic, and then the closet. All right. So I'm super psyched to play this again, you guys. I. I'm very excited to play with you guys. It, I, there should be like secret Easter eggs. Um, that TV would always change channel when you would hit it. I mean, on the PS2, I'm sure it did the same thing for GameCube and Xbox. So we gotta collect as many coins as possible because coins are very vital. Or flowers. Uh, that's the currency in this game. Ah, man, and the graphics oh, for this is just sparkly. amazing. Look, look, look sped up. Okay, okay. Uh, look at that. Look at that. Doesn't he look nice? Exactly. He does. That, that was a rhetorical question, by the way. Alright. I wonder how these coins got up in all the places. There's also hit, hidden Easter eggs, I heard, um, all throughout the game. Uh, so, like, this painting right here is from, like, season two, I think? I, don't quote me on that. I am a big fan of Spongebob, but I don't really know my episodes all that well. Uh, oh. I need a headset. That's the only thing I'm missing, man. All right. Uh, pay 10 shiny off. Yes. Maybe a little bounce on the old bed. All right, there's Sandy. Uh, and you get some underwear. Can I get some underwear? No, I already have a full set. All right, we got 53 coins. You should be able to... Ah, uh, they didn't make the bed bouncy. That sucks. This bed used to be bouncy. Wait, did they make the... Ah, uh, uh, yes, they did. But he always... Did it. <laughs> I forgot what episode that was from, but... Eh. I mean, it's cool. Alright, and this is just a... This is just a tutorial. I, I'm not gonna go through it with you guys, because I already know, um, basically, to, Attack is This is square. where I keep all my old comic books. This is where I keep all my old comic books. I love opening this presents. Thing. This is where I keep all my old comic books. Yeah, you see the same catchphrase. That's kind of weird. Um, yeah, so, okay, square is to attack. Uh, you get new moves as you progress through the game. Um, so, triangle is to do that. Alright, let's, let's get the key keys. Tiki's are very, very important because they give you points. Not points, uh, currency. Or whatever it may be. Um, yeah. And then you could just buy stuff. Because I know uh, Mr. Krabs, he's always asking you for money. And ex I know my Wi Fi connection is lost, alright? You don't need to tell me again. Please. Okay. Boom. And then we have 30 seconds. We need to collect as many socks. Uh, I believe there's. Uh, oh, dude, let's have. Uh, I think there's like a hundred, uh, ah, damn, um, this is I where think I there's keep all my old comic books. Oh, I'm not sure, okay, I got it, okay, that's this fine. Back. Let's get these, uh, flowers, alright, cool, I think I got everything from this room, unless I'm missing some, oh, I am missing something, uh, I think I get there real quick, there you go, alright, so now we're done there, we already have a hundred, you can on the old exit bed. the house if you wanted to. So, let's just go back over here. 50, there you go. See, look at that. We're storming through this, man. And here's our green statue that we have to collect. Um, if I recall correctly, there's 100 golden statues. I could be wrong. Each uh, statue is like 1% of the game. So, I mean, that was on the PlayStation 2 version. I, it could, I could be totally wrong. Because um, I'm not sure if it's the same on every single game platform. Um, but yeah, I'm... <laughs> I'm just gonna be playing it through you guys, uh, playing through you guys, no, I'm gonna be playing the game for you guys, that's how I'm pretty mad. <laughs> um, and I think I'm, we're just gonna get to Jellyfish Fields, or midway through Jellyfish Fields. Um, 
I think that I think that's a decent ah, amount. There is nothing like the sounds of your own neighborhood. Go Trying to steal the Krabby Patty formula oh, again, eh, Plankton? Well, you won't get away with it. I've got bigger fish to fry. I've got to figure out how to regain control of the chum bucket from those robots. I mean, you should have seen it from the very beginning. I'm just saying. Where did they come from? Where? Um, you just said. I don't know. Not for me, though, that's for sure. They just uh -huh. showed up out of nowhere and started calling me rude names and throwing things. <laughs> they even bent all my spoons. Not the I spoons. I love those spoons uh -huh. like they were my children. Jeez. That's <laughs> terrible. Oh, won't you help me stop them before they bend all my forks? Jeez, how is it long? Oh my gosh, Wi-Fi, I know you're lost. Jeez. I'm sorry for my Wi-Fi, by the way. It's crap. Uh, before they bend all my forks. Okay. <laughs> How's this little guy gonna have forks? Imagine him with a big old fork. Not the Never forks! Mind. Of course I'll help! But wait, I'm supposed to collect a whole lot of golden spatulas. Golden spatulas, eh? SpongeBob, if you can get me back into the chum bucket, I'll give you a bucket full of golden spatulas. Right. In your yeah, dreams. Sure. sure. In your dreams. Funny enough, there is a dream level on this, so uh, technically he's not wrong. You've got a deal. All right. So for this part, we're just gonna explore the beginning stages of Bikini Bottom, or our friendly neighborhood, because there is some secrets around here. Um. So yeah, let's just get rid of all these tiki's. For these big tiki's, you just gotta sneak up onto them. It's nothing. Hey, there you SpongeBob! Go. I just dropped by to give you a bubble hand. Bubble buddy. Right. You see, you're going to need to learn some new bubble blowing moves if you're going to journey to the ninth dimension and defeat the giant monkey man. Okay, I don't remember that. But uh, all I need to do is figure out how to get rid of these robots. Right. Oh, yeah. Sorry. I've been in the soap bottle a little too long. Uh, where were we? Uh, something about new bubble moves. Right! Press this button and you'll launch yourself straight up in the air with bubble power that defeats anything that is directly above you. Try it out! Alright. Well, I mean, I already knew that, but thank you. Thank you. Um, uh, and I didn't think on the original game you could get up all the way up here. On this one, you can, but there's just a border, I believe. Oh, 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 damn it. <laughs> oh, oopsie. Wait, it's gonna take me back up there or should it take me back over here? Alright, and there's some like decayed robots. We gotta pass this border. We have to have 15 spatulas to get over there. We could get that within like two episodes, I'm sure. Uh, I will say, I really love the game opening and I will speed through it as fast as possible. Let's talk to Patrick. Okay. <laughs> hey, Patrick. Nice sock. What sock? The one you're standing on. Oh, that one. It's lost. Right. Well, if that That's one's right. lost, where are your other socks? Oh, they're more lost. A bunch of robots sock came through here and stole my whole sock collection. I could use some help getting them back. Oh, sure you, Patrick. thing, Patrick. What are best friends for? That's okay, right. then. For every ten socks you bring back to me, I'll give you a golden turkey golden baster. <laughs> Where did they come up with this you stuff? You mean spatula? Bless you. Oh, man. Bless you, too. You know what? Hey, Patrick, you. Bless you. Patrick needs right. to do laundry. So, to activate this button, a little button, uh, jump on it or jump forward. All right. That's another bubble. It move. shines. All right. Press triangle. Okay. Uh, so, first of all, we are going to press... Man, why are Patrick get some? Sometimes There's pushing a, a simple belt. button is the most satisfying. <laughs> no push, one wants push, to see your underwear push, besides push. Mindy. I, 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 no, Mindy does not want to see your underwear. Right. I take back what I said. That's not what I meant. <laughs> All right. So we have a time limit to get that golden statue up there. Um, and there's also golden uh, underwear where we can extend our life. So that's very helpful. So let's just jump onto this one. Ah, it's, ah, ah, nostalgic. Right back to me. Ah, now I can wear four pairs of underwear. Right. And we got our second special of the day. That's right. And it took us 15 minutes to do that. Alright, let's put this back in here. Oh, damn. 
Damn earphones. All right. Okay. Uh, I believe. Oh wait, we need to visit uh, Mr. Krabs and Squid. SpongeBob. Talk to them. This flapping robot crisis is making the Krusty Krab lose money like a sinking ship. No All money right. means no more Krusty Krab. No more oh, Krusty Krab means no more fry cooking for you. <laughs> no more fry cooking. <laughs> but because you're gullible, I'm gonna help you out, and of course make a small profit in return. I've got a few golden spatulas that I'll be willing to trade to you for some of those shiny <laughs> objects. All right. Oh, I forgot to also mention. Look at my watch. My grandma just gave this to me. Let me. Uh, it's a SpongeBob watch. It's vintage, so well done. I looked it up. I looked it up on eBay. It's like twenty-six bucks, which is kind of great. A watch like this, twenty-six bucks. Let's go. Let's go, Grandma. <laughs> Uh, I didn't mean to sound that in a mean Those way, but stupid like, robots legit. ruined a perfectly relaxing mud bath this morning, and now you show up. Can my Squidward. day get any more dreary? I am so sorry, Squidward. Patrick and I were just playing a game, and oh, I correct myself. I should have known that whole robot problem involved both of you. Right. Squidward, I don't know what to do. How can I fix everything? Why don't you move to another town? That should help out more than enough. <laughs> Move to another Oops. town. I, I cracked me up. <laughs> but seriously, yeah. just jump around like an idiot. Hilarious. That should at least make me smile. <laughs> all right, jump around like an idiot. That's legit what he says. So that's all we have to do, and I think break his stuff uh, as well. So let's just I do didn't that. Know Squidward had let's a just lamp. break all the stuff. I, that that should put a smile on his face, right? I, I didn't do. know Squidward had a lamp. If you guys look at that image right there, that's another from I think season five. I and there's a saw, but like he said, we have to jump around. So another we need to jump see, around. Squidward. I knew that you could help me out. You're the best. Don't touch me. And there you go. That's right. We got a third statue. Let's go. I just spit all over the place. I need to stop spitting. Ah. And the last piece of work, I shall say, is putting a mustache on Squidward's face. It's just, all right, I think we have enough tikis for now. Let's go to Jellyfish Fields. All right, where we can defeat King Jellyfish and get his glorious jelly, if I recall correctly. Because I def definitely did not play this game before uh, when I ordered it. 